Hey guys, camping with Steve here again. We're camping in the back of the pickup truck tonight. Junky old pickup truck. Sometimes you have to have plywood because uh, we all have friends that uh, break our windows, right? Anyhow, I'm gonna, sun is setting fast. I'm gonna set up and we'll do a tour inside of here, have a fire, cook a meal, explore a little bit, maybe, I don't know. Anyhow, uh, another video. <laughs> and let's keep the comments PG. Uh, we're gonna have a good time. Hey guys, it's a lot warmer than it uh, it has been the last little bit in the polar vortex, but uh, in the back of the camper, I've got uh, this setup going on where I'm just gonna do a simple camp out here in the back of the truck, and I gotta start a fire next, but uh, that's what I got in there, and it should keep me warm. I got some powerful sleeping bags, and uh, let's get the fire going, guys. It's uh, it's warmer, but it's still it's still cold. All right, we're gonna get the fire started. <clears throat> um, first, you want to take your fire steel and uh, ferro rod. You got to throw that away and save it for a real emergency. Tuck it away in uh, in the truck somewhere. <clears throat> and uh, what I use is. Uh, basically a uh, home combination fire starter from readily available uh, ingredients and uh, this should get uh, should get it going so you dump in your homebrew uh, fire starter and you take a torch and just get her started. And now you're camping with Steve. Everything is shoveled and uh, in the back of the truck, it's pretty well ready to go tonight. So uh, I can't wait. I think I've earned a little bit of whiskey. Uh, you might know that I do that sometimes. So, whiskey it is. So before I go hunker down, I'm gonna have a little bit of uh, whiskey in a glass. This time, instead of a plastic cup. There, that's a reasonable portion, right? Oh boy. It is uh, very chilly out here, about minus 24 Celsius right now. Uh, we'll see what happens in the morning, but it's actually a lot warmer than it has been. And uh, this is a different setup than normal. I've got the back of the truck there, and I'll show you around it there after we cook some uh, hot dogs here. And uh, cheers, guys. Uh, thanks for coming along. I know it's nothing crazy, but uh, that's what we do. We just go camping as much as we can, when we can, where we can, how we can, and uh, that's the way we do it. Mm. Smooth. Hoo, 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 hoo. It's, uh, yeah, it's colder than spit out here, and uh, time to cook up a dog. Then I'll head in and show you what's happening in the back of the truck which is uh, nothing too fancy, but uh, what am I doing today? Some brats, Johnsonville. The nice thing is uh, they have a Ziploc thing to seal them back up. You can open them right up with the campfire. And uh, oh yes. This is going to be tasty. It's uh, it's kind of strange being so close to the fire. You're you're burning on one side and you're freezing on the other. Last I checked, the temperature was minus 24 or something like that. Something ridiculous. Oh, the 
the entire Ziploc thing ripped off of this. Anyhow, time to uh, cook some cook some brats. All I need on these guys is just a little mustard, and that's the way I like them. If I had some sauerkraut that wouldn't freeze, I would probably have that on there too, but uh, brats with mustard is A-OK -okay in my books. Break refresh buns, you can split open with your hand. Doesn't get much better than this. This is, uh... oh yeah, this is camping. Kind of. Um, Okay, I climbed into the truck and it's showing minus 21 Celsius right now. That will probably get a lot colder tonight, but it's not quite what it was before. However, into the back of the truck and I'll explain how everything's working. Into the back of the truck. Yes. Climb over this. Uh... And here we are on the inside of the truck camper. Um, we got uh, some heat here. It's a Mr. Buddy heater. It has a little pilot light down there, which supposedly, hopefully, shuts off if there's low oxygen. But to combat that, I keep this this window between the front and the back wide open. I don't want any problems. I've got uh, a deep cycle battery there I haven't hooked up yet but uh, that will be running the inverter, which powers the light and charges my phone, etc., etc., etc. And yep, yeah, <clears throat> the back is plywood because some of our friends like to break windows. Uh, anyhow, this is, uh, it's, uh, I got a little cot from, uh, a little cot from uh, Walmart, I think. And uh, underneath of that, I just got a uh, sleeping bag, and I put a foamy inside of the sleeping bag. So I'm going to hunker down, as I do from time to time, and uh, things should be uh, quite cozy in here. It's a powerful sleeping bag, so it's a Woods brand, um, Canmore, four pounds. It's normally... Uh, it's, it's a very cheap sleeping bag I got from Walmart, but uh, we are hunkering down. Gonna be curling up right here. See you guys in the morning. A good night, cold night, but a good night. Uh, gonna hit the road here. Uh, well, gonna go make some breakfast.